Good morning, Ephrata. There's no text bumper? Okay. Well, <laughs> good morning. My name is Dylan. My name is Peter. Today's February, or Monday, February 3rd. Please rise for a moment of silence and the pledge to the flag. Thanks, Kevin. Yeah. The PACAC uh, College Fair is coming up on March 5th. We will be taking a field trip to Thaddeus Stevens to attend the College Fair. Tons of colleges, universities, and trade schools will be there for you to get info and swag. Pick up a permission form today from the counseling office and return by February 7th. Spaces are limited, so be sure to do this ASAP as possible. This announcement is for any students who would like to learn more about the United States Naval Academy as a post-secondary college option. There will be a bus trip to visit the Academy, which is located in Annapolis, Maryland, on Saturday, March 28th. The purpose of this trip is to give interested students and their parents an opportunity to see the Academy firsthand, learn about the application and appointment process, and meet with local area high school graduates who are currently midshipmen at the Academy. If you have an interest in serving your country as an officer, this is a great way to attend college for free, as a degree from the Academy is estimated to be worth approximately $400,000 for the four-year program. Check out the information sheet on Schoology if you would like to learn more. The SAT test will be given at EHS on Saturday, March 14th. The deadline to sign up without a late fee is February 14th. Go to collegeboard.org to register today. Sushi is back starting at lunch today while supplies last. Available in the snack room in the cafeteria and the media center cafe. And now over to Da Joe with the news. Joe Mama. Hey Siri, is it news time? Yeah. Hello, friends. News time. I gotta got a got a birthday hat on because one of you probably has a birthday today. Happy birthday. Uh, two, two, two new hospitals are being built in Wuhan, China, within two weeks to help t assist in the treatment of the coronavirus. Raymond Pond, a head designer at HMC Architects, said the two structures will consist, consist largely of prefabricated hospital components. Each bedroom is built off-site with materials such as aluminum and steel, then brought to the site to plug in and stack up. The exterior of the building will likely be plaster or metal, he believes. The hospitals are being recalled as simple triage, treatment, and recovery centers. On this day in history, the first meeting of the League of Nations was held. President Woodrow Wilson was head of this committee. The purpose of this committee was to promote international sec security as well as world peace. This organization was later replaced by the present-day United Nations. Now over the juniors with the launch. Well, good morning, Ephrata AM. You already know what's up. If you don't know what's up, today, the 3rd of February, we have Mountaineer Cheeseburger, pulled pork barbecue with a whole grain roll, three cheese cavata tapi with buffalo chicken meatballs and a whole grain garlic breadstick, ham and cheese. Ham and Cheese Club with a whole grain toast. French yogurt parfait with a muffin. Chef salad. French fries. Fries. Fresh baby carrots. Or celery with dip. Chilled peaches. Fresh fruit. Or that amazing slushy. Me, 
Friday, Bowling lost 2 to 5 versus Warwick. Boys basketball lost 48 to 56 at CV. Lyle Cop led with 19 on the night. Girls basketball won 82 to 32 versus CV. Oh, everyone clap, please. Yeah. Thank you. Gabby Jarola Hill had seven three pointers on the night and scored 35 for the lead. Sound girls. effect on MP3. Uh huh. Um, <laughs> junior Soyo Bowl and senior Jada Rojas teamed up to win the A division of Lancaster Lebanon League Rifle Pairs Tournament Saturday with a combined score of 415.6. Soyo led with an individual score of 209.5, and Jada backed him up with an individual score of 206.1. In the B Division, freshman Lauren Zimmerman and freshman Christopher Manuel teamed up to place third with a combined score of 404.6. Laura led with an individual score of 205.6 and Christopher backed her up with an individual score of 199. Spring sports signups are underway on Schoology until February 7th. If you are interested in trying out for one of the following sports, please sign up. Bat baseball, softball, girls and boys lacrosse, boys tennis, Boys volleyball, track and field, and unifying track and field. They're different. If you have any questions, stop by the athletic office between classes. But today, there are no sport events. Now back to the main desk. Congrats to the FR Robotics team for qualifying for the state tournament at this weekend's event. The epic blood drive is Friday, February 13th. The signups continue through Monday, February 10th. You can sign up during lunches. Be sure to come show your love for the local chupacabras the day before Valentine's Day. Bye. So, uh, I'm so sorry. My Nintendo I'm not today. I hope tomorrow's better. Have a good day. <laughs>